Why does Bitcoin have value? Bitcoin often gets criticized because people don't fully understand it. The biggest reason for this is because people use money without really knowing how it works. Why do we value the paper money in our wallets? Traditional money like the dollar is considered valuable despite consistently losing its purchasing power over time. We trust it because it's always been a part of our lives and governments say it has value. But what if we could redesign money? What qualities would we want that our current money does not have? Let's take a step back and think where you would rather save your wealth in. A form of money that can be printed endlessly or money with a limited supply. Money printed endlessly drops in value over time, stealing wealth from those who save in it. Money should have a fixed supply to keep its value steady. Like a bank transfer or wire over a weekend, it shouldn't take days and high fees to send money. Instead, money should always be highly portable, quick, and easy to transfer, as cheap and fast as sending a text message. Money should not be controlled by anyone, so no one can seize, manipulate, or block transactions. You can copy Bitcoin's code, but not the value of the currency. All users agree on the real version of Bitcoin, which creates a powerful decentralized network that is too difficult to recreate. Bitcoin fulfills the properties of money exceptionally well. Because it is decentralized, it is secure from attacks and censorship resistant. The limited supply makes it scarce and useful for saving. And because it is digital, you can easily divide it and move it instantly across the world. Bitcoin is not as widely accepted as the dollar yet, but it also hasn't been around as long. As more people become familiar with Bitcoin, many see it as a superior form of money. As millions of users worldwide adopt Bitcoin, its network effect grows stronger, making it easier to buy, spend, and store. The more widely accepted it is, the more valuable it becomes to all users. Bitcoin combines the best of traditional money and digital assets. You might not need Bitcoin today or see the value, but billions around the world do. Those in oppressive regimes, those whose savings lose value, and those who need to send money home cheaply.